the Spanish team making their way out now. Can they record a victory today? Believe it or not, it's the first time that Spain have ever played against the Black Sticks in New Zealand. As the Black Sticks now make their way out to a roar of support from their fans on the far side of the stadium. Aaron Panchia wearing the captain's armband tonight. An exchange of pennants and then their handshakes. That's a good take by Leonard, edge of the circle, looking to find a way in a shot, and it's an opening goal. Well, what a finish from Pau Kamada. You cannot give him that space. New Zealand wanted to get up to a good start, Dean. That's the worst possible start. It is commentator's curse, isn't it? So Leonard, the danger man, wins the ball, stays on it 50-50, one touch, great shot from Kamada. Dane Lett. Right down the right hand side, Kane Russell. Oh, that's gone in. What a touch from Jared Panchir in front of the goalkeeper. There was plenty of pace in from the right hand side, and Panchir, all he had to do was get a stick on it, and he did. Nice and low hand, great defection. Jeunesse just went bang. That's a beauty. High ball from Kane Russell. He's flicked that 50 yards or more. One touch. Bumfa, bottom corner. It was something out of literally nothing. A good pass from Jeunesse into the circle. It goes. Laid across. Oh, it's a good ball on his own. Dylan Thomas has got his goal. New Zealand have a third. It looked as if he was going to square that, and instead it ended up in the back of the net. That'll feel good. First international goal. Nice first touch and underneath the advancing keeper. Comes out to Kamada. It's a dummy to Ramal. Good save. Blocked initially. Shot fired in, and they've got a goal back. Spain have managed to pull one back. The rebound coming out. And it was fired past Richard Joyce on his left-hand side. Mirales gets a goal and gives Spain hope. And off Joyce's pads there. So New Zealand does well to defend the initial shot. Not too much they can do about the follow-up. New Zealand, well, they've had one shootout. That was against Belgium as well, where they drew four all here at this very stadium. They lost the shootout. Gonzalez bursting forward, plays the ball into the D. Joyce has gone a long way there. Well, a mix-up at the back, and Kamada's got his second. It was great work by Gonzalez, but what happened at the back for New Zealand? So he's carried the ball 40, 50 yards. This place, great ball. Then gets a touch on it as Joyce looks to actually close down the cross. So now Xavi Leonard to keep Spain one goal ahead. Faces off against George Ennison. Advances. Ennison comes a long way, Leonard's got round him, play on is the call, but he fires it home on his knees. Oh, the master. I think uh, he had a fair play at this one. Very well to control that ball, and that is a good finish. Exceptional control. But now it is Hayden Phillips against Mario Gutti, and he must score to keep New Zealand in this shootout. Phillips charges off. Slightly to the left hand side, looked to lose the ball. Got in with a wonderful sweep with his stick, and it is now 3 2 in favor of Spain. And if Sergei Enrique can score now, it is another bonus point picked up in a shootout for Spain. Advances, Ennison not committed at the moment. Enrique's turn, Enrique's created space, he's put it home. Spain claimed the bonus point. Four goals to two in the shootout. A 100% record, not only here, but now in the FIH Pro League when it comes to shootouts. I'm sure their coach will just wish they could win in normal time. So Spain and New Zealand, three all is the draw. Spain pick up a bonus point by winning the shootout. Four goals to two.